What if we could combine the simplicity of Siri on our iPhone with ChatGPT? Chat GPT. Chat GPT. Robot you can talk to. Chat GPT. Chat GPT. Chat GPT. It's called Chat GPT. Chat GPT right now is, I think, one of the most hyped things of 2023. And I believe that we're just at the beginning of AI. Yo, what's up, guys? Apple Design back with another video. The things you can actually do with Chat GPT are endless. I've seen people use it to write scripts for YouTube videos, I've seen marketeers use it to write write blog. I've seen people use it for writing code. Like the possibilities are endless. But yeah, wouldn't it be just amazing if you can combine Siri and ChatGPT? You just ask Siri a thing because Siri right now isn't that smart. And then you get the knowledge and output from ChatGPT. But that's exactly what I'm going to show you in this video, how you can get that on your iPhone as well. Okay, so yeah, the first thing we need to do is go to Safari and then we go to OpenAI's web Website. We need to create an account so you can do that here in the footer by going to login and you will be redirected to a new. So if you already have an account, you should just log in with that account. Else you should sign up and create your own account, your new account, go through the steps. You can easily continue with Google or with your Microsoft account, pretty straightforward. So once your account has been made and you're logged in, you'll be welcomed by this screen. And now we need to get your API token. To do that, you press the hamburger menu in the top right and then you go to API reference. In here, you need to scroll down a little bit and you need to click on API keys. As you can see, I already have a couple of API keys created. So if you don't have anything here, you need to create a new secret key. Press on create new secret key. And then yeah, basically a new API key will, will be generated and you just need to copy this. API key copied, hit okay. So next, what you need to do is download my app. I made it, Launchify. And in Launchify, you can download download Launchify for free, by the way, check the description. In Launchify, I've added the shortcut that we're going to use and it's called the ChatGPT shortcut. You can simply press it and then press on add shortcut. All right, nice. Okay, so now simply press on add shortcut. As you can see, I already have it installed. I'll just replace mine with the new ChatGPT one from Launchify. Okay, so now comes the important part. You need to press on the three dots in the top right of the shortcut we just installed. And then you go to get contents off and you press on this little arrow pointing to the right here. Okay, so next what you should do is you need to paste the API key that we just copied and you need to paste it here in the like bearer SK section. So just select that and then we just paste it right here. Just we're just going to verify whether the bearer part also has been added. So yeah, you need to make sure that bearer is also there just like that. If you want, you can even change the name of the shortcut so that if you use Siri and just call upon the shortcut, it's something you really like. So yeah, let's simply call it Siri GPT. It done. All right, and now our shortcut is ready. We can see it. it's this one. I made a couple of others, but this is the one we're going to use. And now, yeah, what's left to do is simply call upon Siri for to initiate the shortcut, and then we can ask any question we'd like to ChatGPT. Oh yeah, and press on allow here when the privacy notification pops up. All right, guys, so yeah, here's the demo of Siri GPT. So we need to evoke Siri and then ask for the shortcut, and then we can just answer our question. Siri GPT. Give us an eggless cake recipe. So that sometimes it takes a little while because it needs to connect to the chat GPT server, but eventually it will come. Yeah, so there we have it. Let's try another thing. Siri GPT, give me five iPhone battery saving tips. There you go, guys. Easy as that. Yeah, I hope someday Siri will be as smart as ChatGPT, but I hope this tutorial was helpful. So make sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, hit the notification bell, and see you in the next one. Peace.